Cum să se sunt la bogda? Am Costă ta, gini? Băi, 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 Zomp everyone, I am back in my village. Today is harvesting day. Let's go. So now I am on my way to see where the people are, where they are harvesting, I guess. I just woke up, everybody they are already into the business. Found them. Wow. Are they, I think they are near, they're closer. I think they are closer. Because I can hear their voice. My nephew. I can let my skeleton. Utako. Orange harvest always reminds me of the stories and experiences told by my cousins, uncles, and aunts when they were small. Carrying oranges in Zerang with friends is not just means to earn money but also a beautiful experience that is filled with joy, laughter and a sense of accomplishment. Zerang, located in the beautiful country of Bhutan, is renowned for its lush green valleys, picturesque landscape and bountiful citrus orchards. Every year during the harvest season, locals and even visitors from neighboring regions come together to pick and carry oranges to earn some extra income. This tradition not only supports the local economy but also provides a unique opportunity for friends to bond and create a lasting memories. My cousins used to say that as the day dawns, The excitement builds up as everyone equips themselves with baskets or bags, we call it doko, eager to start the day's work. The task of picking and carrying oranges may seem simple as the friends delve deeper into the rows of trees, the challenges become apparent. Yet with each step forward, the experience becomes much more rewarding, both physically and emotionally. The thrill of filling one's basket with ripe oranges, carefully plucked from the branches, is accompanied by the constant chattering and laughter between friends, turning work into a fun-filled adventure. The weight of the basket increases as the day progresses, but never dampens the spirit of the friends. Instead, it serves as a reminder for the determination and testimonial of their labor. They joyfully help one another carry the load, combining their strength and encouraging words to lighten the burden. Expert. Helpers who used all the ladder and then doko. Meanwhile, me, I didn't have any of those, so I wanted to help as much as I could. So I started plucking the oranges, which were very near, which were reachable. So yeah, I did what I could.
that did not go well. I mean, it wasn't even like funny because. So, if you have hole inside when you plug it, you're not supposed to like pull it, just rotate it. It kind of like spoils the orange faster because there's hole and then every moisture and stuff. So, we have this specific technique when you plug the oranges, especially when you plug the oranges for harvest. Um, so when you plug, you're not supposed to like pull it. You just need to like twist it in such a way that the orange is still sealed properly. There is no hole here. If you can see properly, it is still closed. Unlike this one, you've got a big hole. So yeah, this is acceptable. This is not. So this we either eat it or yeah. Spread love by sending them to our relatives. Being kind. <laughs> I am done with the lunch and people who are helping us are also having lunch. I really couldn't make video of them eating because it's quite awkward. Um, yep, they're having lunch. Um, I am done with my lunch so I am going to resume the work. I kind of like want to take a rest because I am full right now but yeah I need to finish my part of work my part of job as soon as possible I don't have any ladder or doko so instead of doko I started using bucket and instead of ladder I thought maybe I could make use of this. Ta da! <laughs> Faded <laughs> chair. I mean, it works the same, so. Necessity is the mother of invention. I didn't invent anything, but I'm gonna use, make use of all the resources I have to finish the harvest. Because as you can see, in the weather forecast, it was supposed to be sunny. But I think soon it will rain, which might disrupt with the harvest. So, yep. The helpers are still having lunch. I'm gonna start working myself alone.
termites. There are termites. I think they are termites, I don't know. Just getting everything and going back. Oh god, it's raining heavily. Do you like it? Yeah. Aren't you tired? <laughs> so Uzo wanted to help my dad, his grandfather, um, to carry oranges. Yeah. So here he is. Uzo being such a good boy. Uzo, can you can you do salute? Here, here, here. Okay, jump. Let's go. Morning. Oh, Bolly Pashi. Dawajo? Kunta. Hi. Hi. Kusar sesuatu lah bokta. Amra ini sah. Kusar kusar kami ada. Hey, this is a last step for the day. I am absolutely well, I don't know what I am supposed to say, but I give up. I don't think village is for me. I don't think farming is meant to be for me. I give up. <sighs> oh my god. Please ignore my hairstyle. I am officially done with the orange carrying, harvesting, I don't know, whatever you call that thing. How do villagers, especially the small children who goes for orange harvest and stuff, how do you carry this much of a load? I mean, I could never. I'm like underweight, I'm just 45 kilogram. Maybe that might be one of my excuses, but... <sighs> that she was heavy as hell. I'm gonna freshen up. I give up. The work was too much to the, <laughs> to the point that I had to take a nap and I'm loving it. After my work I took a cold shower. I took a nap and now I am awake and it feels good but my whole body is sore and I can't lift my leg. I am so freaking weak. Butan mache gai ko khole esto banao sa. Butan khola ka dam cha kate ra ni. Ita organic hoon kate isko lagi. Dud dhera yam sa gai ko. Boy. Tishki nera khaye banta poi shab ni dhera jan cha. Tiyan leki bae na bo. Right, you can't miss out on that. Hmm. You can't miss out on that. No, 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 no.
Jersey <laughs> 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 very organic, professional, and ethical. Kola ko damcha. What's up everyone? Welcome back to my challenge. <laughs> oh my god. I'm good. 